And boots and cats 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 and boots and cats. Oh my god, just can you imagine a cat wearing boots? Like They made a movie out of it with starring Antonio Banderas. I, I know, but like, oh god, if if cats always did that, that would be the best. That would be pretty good. Hey guys, what's up? You ever have that moment where like uh like you're angrily eating your food because it dared to burn you? Like you're eating it out of vengeance? Yeah, like, this will fucking show you, burrito. Asshole. Oh, wait. This is the first minute of streaming. Well, goodbye monetization. Hey, we don't really do this for monetization anyway. Not the streams, at least. No, at least not, so, yeah. Hey, what's up? How's everyone doing? How's everybody? Maki Baldwin says, What season? I'm on season two, episode two. What? Uh, I play some game and we'll talk to Grassy Air by win. We're talking Annie to Grassy, man. Hey, we can talk musicals too, you know. You know, I'm not just a Grassy bro. I gotta do shit too. <laughs> okay, so. I was thinking of going back to playing some Soviet Jump because I can't play Fall Guys because. Wow, Our computer is, is like crapping itself out, yeah. Yeah. So play a little bit of Soviet Jump. Maybe we'll hop over to a Jackbox game when uh, more people are around. Mm, where is Soviet Jump? I should just figure that. Oh, fuck, now it's all the way up there. Mm. Man, this is hard. Okay, well, Tarbuck is now in control of the chat because I can't see the chat. Yep. But yeah, I can't tell I'm eating burrito now. Oh, shoot. Okay. Burrito due to hunger. Hold on, we gotta work on... We gotta work on sound here. You want the sound to come out of our speakers? Uh, yeah, or at least make it so, like, uh, the sound's not killing them. Oh, fuck. Hurry up. I know this stuff already. Can I just... Alright, a whole bunch of people bombed in. Uh, yeah. Twilight Moon. Ah. CC's Fashion Thrift. I'm busy. Random ah. Person. And Paper Paper. Paper Paper, I love her name. <laughs> paper Paper Paper. Paper Paper. You know what's a... Okay, why are none of the things working? I get because it. Because if there's a full screen app, it won't do the shortcut to make our, uh, our speaker audio source. No, 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 I'm not short. doing the uh, shortcut. I'm doing the like uh, Windows tab or like Alt tab. Okay, now Alt tab it's... would do it. Windows tab wouldn't. Okay, now I need to I believe I need to bring the desktop audio down a lot. Probably. Okay, and Okay, so first of all, we're going to make it come out of our speakers. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, yeah, there we go. Our speakers are pretty loud. Yeah, because uh, we didn't set up at all. Like, why are we professionals? No, we're not. Twilight Moon has epilepsy. Yes, this game oh. is covered in flashing lights and Shit. patterns. Okay. Uh, we will tell you when you can look back again. Actually, uh, then... Well, let's... Twilight Moon said, um, if, if there is, then I'll just listen and not watch. Yeah, that's totally fine. We don't fault you whatsoever for yeah. only doing, for only listening and not watching. Uh, can you arrange it such that you can still see the video, uh, or not the video portion, the chat portion? Can you arrange it so that you can see the chat, but not the video? We'll just tell you when to drag the window back over. Yeah, like, I I apologize. I don't I don't really know what other game to play, because, like, I don't know what's going to piss off our computer, and why am I not seeing the chat? I'm That's feeling, a good question. I'm feeling sad. Uh, but, yeah... Like, uh, Fall Guys, I want to play that because that's such a fun game and it's easy to just, you know, uh, chat with and stuff. But I, it, our, our computer just can't handle it for some reason. we got to figure out what the issue is before we can even try to fix it. Mm -hmm. um, so, yeah, Twilight Moon, do what you got to do. Like, uh, if you can only see the chat and you have to mainly listen, that's fine. Like, yeah. take care of yourself first and foremost. Mm-hmm. Let us know when you are cool for us to tab back over, and um, we'll continue from there. But we mm -hmm. want to make sure that you're situated first so that yeah. nobody, you know, kills you. Like, yeah, that's the last thing I want to do here. I, well, we're here to have fun, not kill people, okay? Yes. 
And if we killed fans that we recognize, we would swiftly run out of them because people do not come back very often. No, they don't. Here, can you take a scooter, yeah, son? I'll, I'll take the... I'll take a scooter cat. I need to situate myself to receive a scooter cat. Okay, okay. well now, there you go. now I can see the chat. Hey chat, what's up? All right, okay. Twilight Moon is good. Cool, okay. So we're gonna go back. There we okay, go. Okay, so now. Meet Pizza Man. Okay, so how do I, why? Do you have a controller connected? No, I don't. Um, oh, it, okay, there we go. There okay, we go. I need to fuck with the controls anyway, so you keep chatting away. Cutter Historical says, why can't you do Jackbox? It would help Twilight Move Moon get involved, I think. I'm well, I'm, I'm giving it a couple minutes before we do Jackbox, because I'm letting people, you know, file in. It's always slow at the beginning, so I don't want to, like, you know, jump right into the games everyone wants to play. Yeah, there's also the element of, um, like, we don't necessarily know what um like if there is a pattern trigger for twilight moon we don't know if those games have pattern triggers for twilight moon's specific kind of epilepsy like you would have to like twilight moon would have to tell us what's okay and um that would require research to have already been done before the stream which is a it's a bit of an ask to suddenly put that on Twilight Moon. I would, as much as we would love Twilight Moon to be involved and everything, it's not totally feasible um, this instant without some prep. Yeah. Yeah, besides, what, what's more fun than talking to Grassy and watching me make a fool out of myself while trying to, to survive communist Russia? Yeah. Oh, God, I hate this person. Uh, I, 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 I hate this emo. I need to figure out how I can, like, uh, get, a, like, different skins instead of just getting a random one every time. Um, I'm going to soft recommend that you play with a controller because all of I that... tried. I tried. I have tried. Okay, I was testing this out uh, two weeks ago uh, to test the stream, mm -hmm. and that was not going well. Like, I, I could not figure out how to get it to map properly. Do you want to use my special Kingdom Hearts controller? I don't know if that'll fix it. I don't. I don't. I don't know if I'm going to play long enough to really justify all the trouble. Gotcha. Um, well, chat at home. Tell us if hitting the space bar is causing problems. Look at me. I'm a tank boy. I'm gonna run all you guys over. Yeah. Yeah. I'll fight you. I'll fight you. Uh, like a, a, a Beatles looking dude. Yeah. Oh no! It's the Mitrushka doll. What is it called again? Matryoshka. Mat Mat Matryoshka? Close enough. It requires, yeah. like, speaking Russian words requires you to be able to to put, like, four consonants together, and uh, nobody's going to spend the time to learn how to do that unless they're, like, going to be living in Russia or a, or a Russian-ish country. Yeah, unless you're serious about, like, serious yeah. about Russian, you're not going to do that. Yeah. No. The flashing lights that bother me have to be bright, sudden, fast, and repetitive. Okay. Um, I do, I think, um, the pain wall, like, out when I die, that will happen. Mm-hmm. Uh, we'll try to keep that in mind. Yeah, because, again, we want to make sure you're protected. I need to figure out how to yeah. use I'm, this I'm one. currently thinking about the Jackbox games that I actually like playing, uh, to see, uh, to, like, just Going over yeah. my memory to see if I can't um, remember. there's lots of flashing lights. Yeah. Because I remember that Trivia Murder Party has some flashing lights because of, like, light flicker it and does. the lamps in the back. It does, yeah. It's not, like, bright bright, but it does yeah. flicker, so... They're not particularly bright, but we you don't might... know what Twilight Moon's monitor settings are. Yeah, so we might want to stay away from that one. Yeah. Which is unfortunate because Trivia Murder Party is, like, one of my... One of, one of the games that I really like the most... But, you know, oh, we don't want to kill shit. our fans. So shit! I killed myself! Immediately. Yeah. It happens. Uh, don't worry about it. Do you want to try plugging in that Kingdom Hearts controller, then? I mean, we could try it. I don't know. It's, it's just, like, right over here. It would be very quick to grab. Okay, I guess. We'll give it a try, Rabbit. We'll give it a try. 
How's everyone else's weeks going? Uh, it's been pretty, pretty busy over here in the vamp household, I'll tell you that. A uh, bit of an update, I am officially out of hotels. Or, well, like, you know, I'll yeah. be out of there in a couple. On the way. Um, oh yeah, did you, did you post this into the, to the server? Oh, I did not. You want to do that? Yeah, I've got it ready to, to go. Okay, this was my issue, like, uh, it doesn't, uh, register, it doesn't register joy joysticks well. Um, yeah. hang on. Um. What are you trying to do? Hit up. I am, like. Use a D-pad. Yeah, and that kind of defeats the purpose of using D-pad, I guess. Or using a controller, doesn't it? No. The, I... the point of using the controller instead of the keyboard is to prevent tapping from going into the microphone. But... Well, that's, that's not going to be fun. It'll do B. Oh, God, okay. I'm not going to like this, but... Okay, so how do you get out of here? Cool, okay. So then... Alright. Alright, we'll give it a try. I don't like this at all, but <laughs> I do like this little, I don't know, snake man thing that's going on. Oh. <laughs> Faith posted the stream already. Yeah. I'm assuming then that means that Faith is here, and uh, way to go, dude. You are way more on top of it than we are. Congratulations. Well, well, of course. <laughs> of course. Yeah. Yeah. Look at me. I'm, I'm a boyd. I'm, I'm a duck head. I'm a duck, duck head. Duck head. I want the Mitrushka. Mitrushka. I don't, I don't know. Uh, All right. Spinny. I want... No. 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 Yes. You're spinning. Faith, <laughs> Faith says, I did. Right away. Like, as I was tabbing <laughs> over, she was like, I did. Um, nice. Jax X says, I almost missed this. Damn. Oh, well, welcome. Glad, I'm glad you're here. Like, mm -hmm. like, uh, not in the, uh, I, I, I'm so glad my streams uh, are getting uh, people uh, to show up. It's more like, no, no, I'm, I'm, glad, I'm glad people decided, like, I'm worth it. Yeah. I'm like, hey, familiar faces. Cool. Yeah. Faith says... I'm always here and watching. Oh, that's, uh, that's <laughs> not creepy. Uh, Cutter Historical says, Went from filling shelves to working with warehouse trucks this week, even with limited muscle mass. Did some Degrassi stuff, you know. Hmm. Okay. Random person says, Have you guys been since I started school? I, uh, it's been like five weeks. Um. Yeah, it's, oh god, it has been a couple weeks, hasn't it? Hmm. Um, well, I've not been great, honestly. Like, that's why uh, I've not been putting out videos. I mean, the video I'm working on is longer, but it's just also, like... Long I, videos for the win. Long videos for yeah, the win. Yeah, I'm so excited. Like, I am going to spoil it. I'm working on my next Death and Degrassi video. Like, it's finally time, I feel like. So, It only took you a year to recover from the last one. Only. <laughs> my bad, Scoot. I accidentally hit her with my wine. <sighs> I've got three uh, podcasts yeah, in production yeah. uh, for people who care about me, all two of you. You know what I need? I need to start a fucking podcast. I need to find someone to start a fucking podcast with. Uh, uh -oh. Well, Tom said he'd be willing to do a podcast uh -oh, with you. Uh -oh, uh -oh, uh -oh. Get out of the bubble. Get me out of the bubble. God, don't kill me. I want to kill you first. Ha 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 Wow, you are cleaning house. Okay, I want to get this... Okay, that does nothing. Ha ha ha! Die, motherfucker! See, Devastated. Yeah, see, sometimes I'm good at this game, and other times it's like, mm -mm. <laughs> Faith says, amazing impression of my voice, Tarbs. <laughs> <laughs> I want to get this. Oh. Twilight Moon says, my schoolwork year has been going pretty well. Oh, Start I killed myself! Started off rough, but has been slowly getting better. Jax X says, Soviet Battle Royale. I killed myself. I was doing so well. Ah, uh, it, it was in my arrogance. I was trying to chase someone. I killed myself. 
Ah, shit. Okay, well, let's jump right back into it. Well, that's good. I don't, that I... guy looks like Sonic. No, no way. Why, why would there be a Sonic in a Game Grumps game? <laughs> because Aaron unsecretly loves Sonic. Yeah, he finally admitted it. Look at me, I spin. I spin over to this guy, and now I... S uh, okay, fine, I'll, I'll hang out with my own kind. Ah, he's trying to get in between us. I'm, gl I'm glad things are going well for some people, that's good. Like, yeah. I'm genuinely happy for that. Uh, I think I need to grab another device because my phone is at 24. Oh shit, okay, yeah, go ahead which, and do that. like, my phone is optimized so that I can be at 24 for several hours, but that means that for the second half of my day, my phone's going to be totally dead. So I'm, I'm getting on this other device, and I'm going to be watching the stream through that. Okay. Uh, but yeah, as I was saying, I am just about to get out of hotels. Hopefully that has a positive impact on my mental health. I don't know. We'll find out. Mental health, uh, general well-being, uh, capacity for joy. Yeah, like, oh god, it's just been a Lack fucking mess. Yeah, right? Ugh, all, all the COVID idiots. Get me away from them. JaxX says, quick question, have y'all heard of Papers, Please? Why, yes, mm. we have. God, yes. I would play it on stream, but I get so stressed out playing that game. Mm-hmm. Oh, I love it. Uh, JaxX, have you ever seen the uh, short, uh, like, short movie or whatever, uh, like, made uh, based off of Papers, Please? It's so good. I love that game so much. If only it didn't stress me out. Twilight Moon says, Hotels just don't feel like home. Yeah, I mean, yeah. After a certain amount of time, they can. Like, if you say spend a month in Indianapolis just living in a hotel. I Now, see, I moved around a lot as a kid. We were constantly on the road. I feel like a hotel is more like home than any place that I've ever lived. See, I don't, I don't feel that strongly about it. Like, I've mainly worked in hotels. I've not lived in hotels very much. There was a period of time when uh, one of the houses that I've lived in was being built where uh, we just had to be in a hotel for a long time because that was, like, there weren't walls yet. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Yeah, I know there's a lot of people who end up basically living at hotels either because of work or uh because of like stuff like that uh we get a lot of people at my hotel uh for in like you know who are staying there because like uh, the insurance has put them up there because they can't be up there for some reason well i, I want to be a bee i want to be a bee i'm a bee i'm a bee oh you want to fight bee oh ooh, 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 okay i missed him how, how do I be a bee? Oh, that's how I be a bee. I, I, I hit him. I should have hit him. Ah, ha, ha, I hit him. Oh, he oh, hit no. me! Hammer bro. Uh, ha, ha. Take that. Oh, ah, he got me. Okay, Dead. that was actually more fun because I actually got to play. JaxX says, I've been meaning to watch the short film. Oh, you should. I haven't seen it in a while, so I should watch it again, but I remember it being very good. You know, I'm really pleased that the Game Grumps have been able to make video games. Yeah, me too. And I, it also makes me happy watching Dan and Aaron play this game. Like, I wish... They haven't been doing it lately, but I wish they'd go back to doing their uh, streams of this game. Mm -hmm. uh, I do also appreciate their, um, like, a, a lo-fi grump wave uh, streams that they've been doing. Mm. That's been nice. It's not, like the thing I always go to when I want to relax because sometimes like you know they do talk about heavy topics in that in those uh but yeah even still it's like it's nice it is nice right on oh my gosh like um just thinking about how much grumps we've been watching like we basically follow most of their stuff every day right now because yeah they're doing stuff that we're interested in mm-hmm um mostly it's <laughs> It's games that we've either, either done or had long-standing interest in. Like, I'm really into Hollow Knight, mm -hmm. um, conceptually. I haven't actually played it, because uh, who has time for video games when you're not recording those video games? Um, right. Yeah. Oh, oh, Angry Penguin. 
Okay, I'll just unleash that Angry onto the England. world. But now it's coming from me, so I gotta get the fuck out of here. I didn't know that wasn't a power up. Uh, I don't think it is a power up. Wait. I mean, I'm not. I'm not gonna trust it. Oh, that's definitely not a power up. So I'm gonna go away. Gotcha. Um. I want a power up. And then the game that they are playing that we have done on the stream, uh, not on stream, but just generally speaking, we have in the past done a game of um, Mario Galaxy Two. Yeah. The Babby game for Babbies. I don't know. Like, watching them play, it kind of makes me appreciate it a little bit more. So, the first half of um, Mario Galaxy 1 is really good, and the second half of Mario Galaxy 2 is really good. But, the second half of Mario Galaxy 1 is also really good. So, like, <laughs> what, you, what you gonna do? Wanna be hackers, code crackers, yeah, there's... When they come for you? Yes. Uh -huh. Different songs, same decade. Oh, is it? I, I don't know the song that you're talking about. It is a Weird Al parody of um, All About the Benjamins. I don't even know that song either. Ah. Eh, I don't yeah, want that You don't seem like the kind of person who would, like, encyclopedically oh, deep dive um, on... <gasps> Bitch, kill! No, don't kill me! I need to get out of here! Encyclopedically deep dive on, uh, <laughs> like, early 90s hip-hop. Okay. That doesn't seem like your your era. No. I need to get out of here, the pain wall. Yeah, I'm not really into early 90s hip-hop, like, uh, that sound. Hmm. Like, oh, God. Like, my sister, one of my older sisters was into, like, uh, l like uh, early 2000s uh, music, and so I got exposed to some of that, but hmm. not quite the same. Like, I think, what was it, Lil Sean or something? Yeah. Did I pee? Uh, none of your business. <laughs> oh, it's closed off. Oh, fuck me. Uh, no, 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 no. I am, I'm dead. dead. Ah, shit. Uh, like yeah. half, half the game is running from the pain wall if you end up in the wrong spot. <laughs> shit. Random person. I haven't watched Degrassi in weeks because of school. Yeah, I need, like, um, I'm thinking maybe at the end of the month, like, Maybe on a Saturday or Sunday, uh, because uh, that's when I'm looking to be, uh, like, actually out of hotel. And I don't think I'll be starting my next gig uh, right away. So I'm thinking of doing another Degrassi watch-along through Discord. Because, you know, I haven't done one this month yet. And yep. I like doing those. I like using it as an excuse to rewatch Degrassi. Not that you ever need an excuse to rewatch Degrassi. Here, let me, let me play a bit so that you can eat. Oh, okay. I'm just, like, uh, trying to figure out who I was. I thought I was uh, this little uh, black dude right here, but now I'm the stupid uh, bearded guy again. Uh, hey, yeah. There we go. Run. But, yeah, I think I'm definitely overdue for another Degrassi rewatch. Uh, just, you know, I, I like, just because I like watching Degrassi, and then I do forget certain things, like... There's so much of Degrassi that's so easy for me to forget if I'm not constantly exposed to it. That's why, um, once upon a time, I used to watch, like, the entirety of Degrassi while working, you know, like, uh, for videos or just cause. So, mm -hmm. how come you never run? How do you run? Hold the B button. In oh. this case, uh, hold action and you'll run. Oh, okay. Uh, I don't know, because I don't know the controls very well. I've not been playing very long. Spinny, spinny, spin. Mm-hmm. No, I don't. It doesn't matter. Stop that. It might. Man, it's probably annoying to listen to, but I like how clicky the controller is. What is the point of not using the keyboard, how clicky it is? No, it was so that this didn't happen. When would I do this? Um, hitting the space bar travels into the microphone really strong. Lame. All right. Hope I can okay. join the watch along. I can go ahead and play. Unless you want to play. I want to play one. Okay, well, I can't. Hope I can join the watch along, but honestly, I don't know because school night uh, is a no. Yeah, I get you. That's why, um, that's why I was trying to make, uh, 
watch longs and streams and stuff on a uh, weekend like um like Fridays or Saturday nights um for discord like uh, our movie night watch longs I don't know I don't think I'll be able to have them on that because I know some people don't ha have availability on the weekends but you know I'm trying to I'm trying to see what works best for everyone uh, fucking school like you know gang in everyone's way that's all I'm saying Jeez, you're trying to... You're really trying to get Doggo over here, aren't you? Yep. Yes, I am. Oh, look, and you found more people. When did Doggo get a hat? Damn. Uh-oh. Run. Watch your skin. You don't have armor on. Ooh. Back to being a bee. Step away from the light, Sora. Become oh, a no, beekeeper. No, no, no. All oh, right. someone died. Time to run. Mm-hmm. Time. Oh no! Don't. That's go an enemy. Yeah. This is tricky. Mm-hmm. Because like, you need to get power up so you can kill people, but you don't. But you can't like die from the pain wall. No lollygagging. Mm-hmm. All right. What oh. is this? Oh, you're a tools, bro. Oh, nice. Gotcha. I'm basically a hammer brother. Yeah. My dog is dead. She's oh, dead. My boy. dog is Glitch. dead. She's dead. Got hit by a truck. Ran out of luck. My dog is dead. I, I think uh, that glitch is uh, just part of the aesthetic. Yeah, I'm positive that it is. But uh, you, you can go down pipes um, if you down arrow. Yeah. Gotta... I usually do that to get away from people or to find people, but beware pain wall still is around. And I barely I... know where I'm going. Yeah. Well, there we I go. I told you. I I head back the other way. It no, just... no, no, no. You no, you were walking towards it. You wanted to die. I was trying to get enough room to build up momentum to run away. Here you go. No. No. I lasted a long time. That's something. You I did. also like I almost killed somebody. You almost killed somebody. Yeah, well, that's a consolation prize. All right. Um, Faith says Clicky does not bother me. Random person says uh, the fact that my school has a schedule and we're online and it starts at seven twenty eight a.m. is aggravating because like the homework they give us is like double the amount that they normally would and I well, have to of stay up. Of course, um, it's double the amount because the school uh, is about control. It's basically about, it's, it's just a practice, like way to for the system to practice oppressing people so that they get used to it. And well, when they that even way, if when you get out, you're just willing to accept the oppression that is given upon you. Even if it's not by design like that, that is what it ends up being. It ends up being basically entirely like we have to control these kids. We have to. Uh, you know, keep them in line. Like, uh, with how, like, they expect you to sit at a desk at age five for eight hours a day. But that is by design. It was very intentional. That's, it, that's the thing about the Industrial Revolution, is that, like, yeah. the, the way that schools were built was meant to emulate factories. I see. That's even better. Because it was designed okay, to produce factory now. workers. Look at me, I'm just so jolly. Hold B while you run. Oh, oh, I need to go down. I'm just so jolly. My mom says school helps us with deadlines, even though more than half of us students procrastinate. Uh, the thing is, though, that it doesn't really help with deadlines because all of the things are made up. You know, what helps with deadlines is, Ooh, what's that? you know, real Whoa. consequences okay. for those deadlines. I'm a little uh, drunk right now. Uh, you suck down the green fairy. That's, uh, that's a lot to take in. Yeah, I'll say, like, uh, school didn't really help me with deadlines. Like, it helped me, uh, with, um, what do you call it? Uh, it helped me understand, uh, what conditions I need to be under to fucking asshole. Uh, to, like, operate in certain ways, but that's not... God damn it! Oh. Oh, I killed myself. But, it's not... It doesn't help anyone with deadlines, because a lot of people still miss deadlines, because, you know, 
it sucks. School actually conditions you to ignore deadlines because there's yeah. no actual consequences for missing any of those deadlines. Meanwhile, uh, if if I miss a deadline, um, somebody files like a dispute against my my shop, and I yeah, or, have or, to or, like, give yeah. them their money back and stuff. Yeah, or you or uh, you don't file your tax right away, and suddenly it doubles. Yes, <laughs> your taxes do double, <laughs> or. Otherwise, you suffer many penalties when uh, you don't, if you were to miss that particular uh, deadline. So, uh, yeah, whereas, real life deadlines are important, and uh, school deadlines are fictional. Yeah, yeah, like, because with school deadlines, they often just, like, uh, extend them out anyways, or, like, something like that. But, like. Can you tell that we hate school? It's sad because I did enjoy my time at school, but. The more, like, I think about it and the more I hear about how school is changing, it's just, it's disgusting. It's been exactly this way for hundreds of years. Well, yeah, it's been this way, but, like, how it, when I say how it's changing, I'm talking about, like, how it's adapting to new technology. Badly. Yeah, like, oh, God, like, uh, the person, uh, like, who... Uh, got reprimanded for just turning away from the Zoom call to get a charger, like to plug in the laptop. Man, I yeah. love that tweet. I think about it often. Yeah, and I think about a lot, like when I think about school, like how, uh, like strict they are. Excuse me, with bathroom passes or like letting kids go to the bathroom at all during class. Like, what the fuck do you expect? Like, in no other, like, working condition, except for an abusive working environment, do they stop you from going to the bathroom. Yes, that is... And then, when you get to college, they treat you like you're defective for oh thinking God. that you have to ask to go to the restroom. Yeah. When you've oh. been, like, when you're bullied about that by the by the system. F- f- and, <laughs> fuck. I yeah. hate, I hate school. Yeah. I hate it so much. I, I love... Uh, in college being able to just walk out the classroom if I wanted to. But you know what's fucking stupid? Some colleges are taking attendance now and having to count against, like, count against you or something. And it's like, we're paying, like, you're, we're paying the school to teach us, okay? It's, like, it's, it's not, all about control, and it always yeah. has been. God, and it used to it used to be at one point that colleges had a lot more freedom than, you know, the public schools uh, would have, but now it's it's basically acting uh, interchangeable. And I hate it. I, I hate it so much. Also, on that note, I'm thinking about uh, since, like, uh, the, the job I'm going to be transitioning to uh, has the opportunity for me to make more money, I'm considering possibly uh, using that money to take some uh, Japanese classes. Holding B makes you jump higher as well. Oh, okay. You would have to build up a little bit of momentum. Yeah. A little bit of momentum, but you, it does make you mm. jump higher. Cool. Um, let's see. Uh, but yeah, I want I want to take some Japanese classes. I have not this... the college's fault for attendance. It's financial aid stuff that's forced upon the schools. Yep, yeah, but they control what those terms are. That is negotiated. They're a lot like. It, it's not like it. It's just set from on high that you must do this. It is. Ha <laughs> ha! Killed them. Like. They, they they strike deals with the state to do stuff like that. Yeah, people, like, people in colleges make the rules. They don't just happen. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Ooh, almost got him. Uh, what? What? Oh, two hits. Box That's what it was. Ha! Got a... Killed him! Um... Jax X says, have y'all ever listened to WAP? Uh, I listened to portions of it because I was listening to the, uh, like, uh, 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 Todd in the Shadows review. I don't really have interest in listening to all of it, but it's like, oh, that's fine. Ah, oh, fuck! That's all right. Yeah. Um, it's, like, hot take, it's kind of normal. <laughs> Uh, like, uh, like I understand why people are like, oh, blah, 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 because it actually uses, like, a pussy. Yeah, but, like, oh, oh, if anybody cares, I strongly recommend looking up the Ben Shapiro version. Oh. <laughs> that oh. was hilarious. Shit. Okay, I see how that works. <laughs> yeah, wet-ass P-word. Wet-ass P-word. That's, 
like I say that all the time. Oh, oh, that when, hurts. In, okay, in, gotcha. When referring to that, uh, uh, that that song, I, I wet want, ass p word. Like, I, part of me wants to use it, but mainly because, like, say pussy, you freak. Yeah, yeah. Uh, <laughs> I also don't want to be the kind of person who says, you know, what fucking hell, wet ass p word, like unironically, like I don't want to she pussy. I mean, it is the worst name for vagina. I hate it. I hate yeah. it so much. I hate it more than clunge. Oh god! Oh clunge god! Clunge is so oh, much more pleasant to say than than pussy. No, it's not. I, I hate, hate. I fucking hate clunge. I don't get you. Clunge, plunge, though. Oh, look at me! I'm dangerous now. I'm swimming in a tank. I am swimming in a tank. <laughs> swimming in a tank. Swimming in a tank. Oh, pain wall! I found the pain wall. Twenty-five assignments a week. Five assignments a day. God. That's a ridiculous amount of work, and I would, yeah, like and if I was a parent, I would say something about it. You know, the best part is that uh, it's been a uh, sh- fuck. Uh, it's been shown that uh, a homework doesn't uh, like a like, homework consistently decreases. Uh, oh God! Oh God! Oh I, I, yeah, homework does not actually teach you or make sure anything gets like uh, like uh, lodged in your brain better. It's just busy work. Yep. It's just something for the teachers to say, like, oh, they're doing something. It's to condition you to to the fact that work is inescapable, yeah. and you can never be free of your job, Oh God. even in your own home. Yeah, talk about jobs that uh, expect you to uh, watch and then uh, respond to emails after you get off the clock. That is some real bullshit. There. If, if I'm expected to have any responsibilities outside of working hours then those hours will be charged for like that's that's the real rule here is you're paying i'm only yours while you are paying me and if you are not paying me then i am not yours like i can understand uh like instances where it's like you know managers and they always have to be on like uh so then uh, their underlings can you know uh contact them and like with problems and stuff okay but that's in the job description and but that's also it, uh those people are salary yeah <coughs> that's the although, point of salary although salaries uh, can be pretty uh, bullshit too but for because your reasons. actual hourly rate on the salary can be anything well, well, like, more like, uh, oftentimes salary people end up working a lot more hours, but not for any overtime pay. Right. Yeah. Um, but if you say, like, work in an office and you're expected to, uh, like, respond to your emails even after no one's in the office, then it's like, no, there's literally no reason to do that. Yep. Eh, good. Yeah. Okay, I think we'll do one more, and then we'll move on to Jackbox. Uh, Cutter Historical says, There is a hot take on the Degrassi Reddit about Rick Murray and how... Okay. Uh, uh, what and is how it? the poster thought Rick deserved the paint and feathers, and uh, I don't even feel like finishing reading this. Okay, I get the gist. I disagree. I, And you know what? I also hate discussions of what people deserve, because I don't feel like I can really... Yeah, they're not basing it on anything. Yeah, it's just all based on like uh, you know what you feel and stuff. And it's yeah, like, it's just you know? it's just vengeance. It's and for that matter, it's retroactive vengeance. It's like you deserved this in the past because in the future you did something bad. Well, well, well technically, uh, the uh, uh, like with Rick, um, I mean, I'm sure part of it is that oh, in the future he shot Jimmy, so that's why he deserved it. And, like, I mean, I don't know the render, so I can't say for certain, but. I've also seen people, like, you know, argue that he deserves certain things because, uh, you know, he was the one who beat Terry in the first place. Hold B. I, 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 I was. Yeah, and I wanted it. I, I was holding B initially, like, when you weren't looking, and I was running to the pipe. I want to play the smart. Okay, I'm not smart enough to play this. <laughs> okay. That's okay. Matryoshka! No! <laughs> God damn it! No! No, 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 no! Leave me alone! You're not holding B, so you're not running fast. Uh, but because. C- oh, shit, I want. No, I wanted to power up. Aha. Take that. Eat it. See, it's hard to hold B when. Oh, fuck. That's why it's normally X. Okay. 
It's hard to <laughs> do any dash button when I have jumps right in fucking front of me. I do it. Yeah, because I don't know, okay? I, I hold the B button and jump at the same time. Okay, but I you don't. Do that, though. Like... It's a, if you want to get better at this game, that would be something to work on. Yeah, it's something to work on, but... Okay, what's going on with the chat? Absolutely nothing. Nothing has happened. Ah, cool. Um, random person says, I find it funny that my sister thinks I'm overreacting and she has a heart, or because she has college-level classes, she clearly doesn't understand how my brain is. Yes, people who have d different needs find different things difficult what a what a novel concept if only yeah. we could get anyone on earth to understand that who hasn't personally experienced it i also hate the whole well your your problems aren't aren't meaningful because i have it worse it's like fuck off because the point isn't that oh like it's it's the african orphan orphan fallacy okay your problems suck that's great but there being worse problems in the world doesn't mean they suck less Mm -hmm. Like just because doesn't mean. It's like in the grand scheme of things, it doesn't it doesn't matter that m much. That that doesn't help how it feels right now. Mm -hmm. And you know, it also doesn't like clear away the pain either. So it's like uh, I hate people who think like that. I just hate it. You know what? I'm also gonna go off on uh, people who. Oh, God, stop burping. Ugh. While we're on that note, I'm going to do the other Vic and Hope reference and just crack a can directly into the microphone. I'm I gonna... really like Vic and Hope. Yeah, I can tell. I'm going to go off on people who, uh, like, hate characters and call it, uh, it's be like, claim that it's because of bad writing. No, you just hate that character. They're not, they're not the character for you. Calm the fuck down. Like, I got another one of those, oh, I think... I think people uh, find Ashley so unlikable because uh, uh, the writing's so bad. Like, uh, Craig was a hot mess, but, you know, at least he developed or something. And, oh, but Ashley never, like, uh, had the character development. So, you know, bad writing. That's why no one likes her. It's like, no, no one likes her because she's not a great person. Yep. Any other justification is, is an after-the-fact to that. No, I lost my beach ball! Did he just super jump off of you? What the hell was that? I don't know. Oh, he killed me. Uh, okay, we're out of this, I guess. Um, Team Berserkion says, you might, ha you might hate me. We don't. N like, there's no real end to that sentence uh, that's, that's realistic of you that uh, we would hate you for. Oh, wait, no, um, I don't. Please press again. But I haven't seen the first nine seasons of TNG or Junior High or High. Like, dude... That, that's fine watch whatever part of a show you're gonna watch and like you're not a, you're not a bad person or to be hated because you haven't seen part of a show yeah like i i think you should go back and watch them but yeah uh, honestly there are way more important things for me to hate people about so yeah. but you're good more importantly uh if you're going to hate someone hate people that would hate you for not watching a show <laughs> yeah oh yeah, um, let's see. People always tell me this character sucks and this character is so good. Um, y yeah, I mean, I feel like we already sp spoke our piece on that one. Let's see. Like, everyone I know hates this Emma character and Craig is better than Eli. Who is uh, Ashley? Bitch, please. <laughs> yeah. Um, <laughs> random person said is probably think we have the same brain uh, she probably thinks we have the same brain because we're twins but we're clearly not because i have depression and she doesn't um it's a lot of factors that go into something like that but uh you're yeah. not the same just because you're twins yeah i mean like not like i have to there, tell you there's but, um, been studies i'm just <laughs> there's been studies <laughs> this elf lord i heard i talked to <laughs> i really like the the xkcd um word filter that replaces a study with tumblr post what <laughs> okay um so yes there are there have been studies um i am generally critical of people who don't like 
actually cite those studies because a lot of people do just say that, even though I know that's not what the hell is happening. I don't know. I think I broke steam. Um, I broke steam. Gotta vent that steam. Gotta vent that steam, steam, steam. Oh yeah, guys, if you want to send us video games to play on the stream or something like that, uh, we would want to check it out beforehand, but uh, uh, we'll show you the name to send it to in a minute, I guess. Would people actually do that, though? Uh, people send video games to Dan and Aaron all the time. Yeah, because they're Dan and Aaron! I'm not Dan and Aaron! You're no, not Dan and Aaron! No, but you're fun like Dan and Aaron. No, I'm not. Yes, you are. No, Dan and Aaron are, like, wholesome, but also sometimes gross. Okay, so you're just wholesome. What now? Uh, shit, I don't have anything going for me to do, do mm, it. Mm-hmm. Oh, no, if I'm only wholesome, then what am I doing? Uh, Jax X says, uh, do you like 21 Pilots? Um. Yes. I'm, I'm, uh, I'm going to give them a soft upvote. Like, I haven't listened to much of their material, but there was a couple of songs here and there that I listened to from them that I thought was good. I liked, uh, yeah, there are a couple songs that I do like. Um, there was something that I heard that I can no longer remember that made me think, hmm, big ha. Huh. But I, lo I no longer remember it. I also don't, I'm not ever going to, like, look into them, really, because I don't think I'm in the mental state to be able to handle that. You are not. Like, the deepest I can go is, God, what's that song called? Um, uh, my name's, uh blurry face and uh stressed out like that's the deepest i can really go that's a 21 pilot song yeah my name's blurry face and i care what you think okay so i think we should start off strong with survive no 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 uh i was gonna say bracketeering that's the thing that i wanted to say bracketeering Trink trinket mage has it right at cutter historical all that rick deserved was more therapy better parents and a transfer yep reach Yep. See, and that's one of the things I hate about the whole deserve thing. Like, basically watch uh, uh, ContraPoints' video about justice. Like, it's all retributive, like, um, you know, like, you have to pay for this thing that you did. And it's like, it's not ever trying to actually make them into, you know, like functioning members of society it's always about you need to pay don't fix distance and blame yeah which is kind of fucking bullshit yeah i hate that but yeah in other news let's get on everyone go to jackbox uh, doc tv to play along with us you can do this on your phone you can do it on your computer you can do it on your tablet hey i'm not judging you you can even do it on your ipod touch yeah Go to jackbox.tv to play along with us, although I need to be the first one in because uh, uh, that's what I always do. Because I'm the VIP vamp. Okay, so I'm going to hop in here first, and then it'll give us a room code so you can play along with us. Okay, the vamper dude. Oh, it cut off my name, but my name is Vamper Doodle. Aren't you gonna join? Um, maybe. This um, is bracketeering. You love bracketeering. I do enjoy bracketeering. You can grab my iPad if you want. Uh, I'll pull it up on my phone. I think I think my phone is able to handle it. Probably. Okay. Maybe. Cola. Kinda. Blah. Ran. Thoughts on L.A. Complex? I've never seen it or heard it. What is it again? <laughs> uh, that's that's my thoughts on it exactly. Oh God, I love my scooter. Cut is here, too. Scooter's just looking up at me. She's on my lap with her head against part of the blanket and just looking up at me like, this is your life. This is what you do with your Saturday nights instead of going out to the bar and getting COVID. <laughs> going out to the bar, getting COVID. Yeah. You know, I, I, I do, like, I keep having this fantasy of one day trying a bar, but... I know I'm never going to fit into it. Total waste of time. Yeah, like, I hate I hate the kind of people who go to bars and... Well, I, okay. I hate the kind of people that I've been exposed to who go to bars. Okay? Mm -hmm. I'm not... Not to, like, harsh on anyone. Hello, big. Um, I remember but, being in a conversation with some guy who was like, so what kind of bars do you go to around here? And I'm like, bar. none. And he's like, what? 
where do you drink? And I'm like, I don't drink. And he's yes. like, you fucking liar. You just don't want to hang out with me. I'm like, no. I mean, yes, but also I don't go to bars. <laughs> yeah, that guy sounds like someone you wouldn't want to hang out with and sounds like the to- totally the kind of person who I would find at a bar who I'd be like, nah. Right. See, because, like, I want to go to bars, like, try a fun, fruity, <laughs> yummy mixed drinks, but... I don't want to become drunk and put myself uh, in a position where I'm vulnerable. And I also don't want to have to deal with drunks. That's right. like, and it's like, that's basically what bars are for, I guess. Everybody's in. Yeah. I also wouldn't want to bring you to the bar because I know you wouldn't have fun. I would not have fun. Not at all. Yeah. I like talking to people. I like talking to sober people. Yeah, we're going to skip the tutorial because... You know, I don't think this game really needs a tutorial. Basically, uh, answer the prompt, and uh, whatever your thing is... Let's see it. Oh, Um, hardest word to spell correctly. Okay. Hmm... This is difficult because I instantly know the word, but I just have to guess at how it's spelled. I don't know. This is a, a word that was hard to spell in first grade. I don't know. Trinket Mage says arcade bars are okay. If you mean Dave and Buster's, Ooh. which is basically just drunk Chuck E. Cheese, then yes. Should I go? Is that what Dave and Buster's is? Yes. Okay, I should go to Dave and Buster's. Okay, uh, what's the hardest word to spell correctly? Forgiveness or Constantinople? I have no issues with uh, uh, forgiveness, so I'll go with the other one. Asparagus or restaurant? Fuck! <laughs> How do you spell either of those? <laughs> I literally have I literally have to relearn how to... God damn it. Uh, spell... Onomatopoeia is harder. Yep. Uh, uh, I, I literally have to relearn how to spell restaurant every single fucking time. Yep. Ugh, God, I can't talk. Uh, Cutter Historical says, I hated that one guy's post, but a few of the points he made, um, was wrong to like how Rick was bullied and wrong to hate Emma for being near, all right, I... Wait, hey, Emma for, Emma for what? I would have to scroll back up when we're not doing this game. Okay, okay, yeah. <laughs> I hate how people say Emma was leading him on. It's like, no, she fucking wasn't, you assholes. You've never seen a nice guy before in your life, have you? Because Rick was totally the nice guy. He's like, because like, oh, Emma wasn't being a total douche to him. Oh, she must have feelings for him. Those are the only two states that a person can be in. God. Yes, vote for mine! Uh, I learned how to spell this word in, like, first grade, and it stuck with me. Istanbul, the Constantinople, no, it's Istanbul, the Constantinople, why is it Istanbul, the Constantinople? Uh, like, uh, it, it's long time, uh, no, 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 I love the song! L- long time gone, Constantinople, why Constantinople get the works? That's nobody's business but the Turks. Actually, I'm going to go with definitely, because I feel like I can figure out how to spell supercalifragilisticexpialidocious. Yeah, that's, like, the the phonetics of it are yeah. really simple, but okay, fine. <laughs> okay. Outvoted. It's <clears throat> supercalifragilisticexpialidocious, even though the sound of it is something quite atrocious. Uh, if you say it loud enough, you always sound precocious. Supercalifragilisticexpialidocious. I'm diddly, I'm the lie, I'm diddly, I'm the lie, I'm diddly, I'm the lie. Ooh. Oh boy. Mary Poppins is unironically a decent movie. A decent? It's unironically decent. Yeah. Like, I literally like it. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I don't love it, but I do like it. Uh, Return of Mary Poppins, unironically not great. I feel like I could figure out onomatopoeia. Restaurant, not so much. I should be able to figure out restaurant by this point in my life, but, you know. Uh, no! Restaurant! You fool! It's just us. Only we have problems <laughs> with restaurant, apparently. No, I don't believe it! I, I can't believe it. Uh, 
Okay, Supercalifragilisticexpialidocious versus Constantinople. You know which one's the right one in your heart. Yes, I do. Yeah. No, the people who are voting for uh, Supercalifragilisticexpialidocious are wrong! You're fucking wrong! Yeah, that's the right way to go. No, fucking hell. No, 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 no. No, I feel like you're changing your votes to spite me. <laughs> God damn it. I shouldn't have said anything. You should not have. But why, though? <laughs> oh, sad. <clears throat> Onomatopoeia. Okay, it, it's for me, it's onomatopoeia, because I would not have figured out after I, that P. Yeah, I can't even tell if that's spelled correctly as it is. Yeah, right? All right, congratulations, Jazz. You got that one. Oh, I just feel so calmed every time I look at my scooter. Random person says, can you say hi to my friend Flynn? Because they're scared to say hi. Hello, Flynn. Oh, hi, Flynn. How's it going? Uh, it's okay to be... A, well... It's okay to be, you know, afraid to say hi, but also, like, feel free to hop in. We don't bite. I, I really like it when people, like, say stuff in the chat. Like, that's what, that's the whole reason for the stream, to be able for me to talk to you guys directly. And also, hopefully entertain you as well. Uh, name any item or ga kitchen item or gadget. Is a cat a kitchen item? <laughs> uh... Uh, Jack's X left on accident. Uh, oh, no. Uh, well, shit. Well, get back into it, and if it, saved well, your, if it saved your cookie in your browser, then you'll just be able to come right back. It'll be fine. Well, just, just go I don't, for it. I don't know if they'll actually let him back into the game, though. I might. No, I, it'll put him in the audience. You never know. Okay. Okay. Um, what is most likely to finally bring, for the love of God, bring me some happiness? Uh, I don't know. I don't know. Kitchen <laughs> items, what would do that for you? I don't know. Like, shit. This is, um... Interesting, to say the yeah, least. Yeah, I have a prediction about what will actually win if it comes up, but... Um, we'll see. Let's see what the options are. Apple peeler or apple cutter. What's... Isn't that just a knife? Uh, no, they make apple, like, things that cut and core an apple. Okay, I'm then I'm going I, with apple I'm peeler. Go I'm going with apple cutter, because, like... Something that can core an apple? Fuck yeah. We have one. We do? Yes. <laughs> I never use it. When do I go in our fucking kitchen but to get burritos out of the freezer? Well, to tell me to make you something. Yeah, exactly. But I don't need to go into the kitchen for that. I don't need to dig through our drawers. Hey, Tarbuck, how about some bannock? Hey, Tarbuck, how about some eggs? Hey, 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 you made the bannock of your own volition, okay? Yes, I did. It was delicious. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Uh, if you're making bannock at home, use rice flour. It's better. Everything's better with rice flour. Not uh, everything, but most things. Okay, so you're the asshole who took an egg beater when I was going to take it. <laughs> uh, garbage disposal makes me very happy. I gotta vote against myself. Uh, you were the asshole who did it? Yes. Oh, we are so on the same wavelength. Mm -hmm. <laughs> we both thought the same one. Were you also thinking of the manual kind of, egg, like, the, the reciprocating egg beater, the one that we have? No, I was just thinking egg beater, because that's the thing that people have in the kitchen. Ah. It was just generally egg beater, that's a word. Spatula versus whisk. Um. I mean, spatula is more useful than a whisk. But, I use a spatula but, way more, but whisks are for making frosting. Yeah, I was going to say, whisks are for making uh, yummy things. So, I'm going for whisk. I mean, I'm, I also I also have an investment in it because it's mine, but still. Yeah. Now, I'm a spatula boy. I love my spatulas. I ha That's why I have so many. <laughs> okay. But whisk is where it's at. I gotta I, give it up for the whisk. I didn't... A ladle or a grater? 
Oh. Ladle. Absolutely ladle. Hands down ladle. I'm going greater. I they love... They take up so much space on the counter. But I love shredded cheese. I like shredded cheese, too. They shouldn't be, like, that giant block, though. Uh, oh, shit. Uh, uh, come on! Fight for the graters! Fight for the graters! Fight for the graters! <laughs> ah, I don't have a quick enough thumb. Yeah, meanwhile, I've been playing button mash games for 30 years, so... <laughs> uh, Only four more years than me. Koa! Hey, it's Koa. Cool. I see Koa, and I think of this uh, one camping magazine. Little Demon says hi. Hello, Flynn. Presumably. Hello! Uh, what's um, up? Um, phone? You gonna... There we go. I don't know. Like, in general, I don't like going on the Degrassi subreddit because I see a lot of the same bad takes all the time. I'm just kind of tired of it. Stefan Brogan uh, directed several episodes of L.A. Complex. It's oh. a show. With, uh, it's a Canadian show. Went for two seasons. Stars Cassie Steele trying to make it in the city. Okay, that's where I heard it. Okay. Hey. Uh, garbage disposal. That is way more helpful than an apple cutter. Okay, I think, yeah, I did hear a little bit about that. And that's interesting. Okay, I didn't know Stefan Brogan had, like, has done more directing outside of Degrassi. Good for him. Yeah. That's probably what he was doing when Degrassi went on indefinite hiatus. Um, no, I think uh, L.A. Complex, that came out, like, um, in between Degrassi seasons or something. Like, uh, sometime, like, when it wasn't canceled. Or at least that's my memory of it. I don't know. Whisk versus ladle, a whisk. It brings me happiness. That's why I can say. Yep, frosting, frosting yeah. every day. Frosting, meringue. Um, oh God, all the all the yummy things that I can't eat right now. The the filling of tiramisu. You use a whisk to make that in many many yeah. ways. You can make cloud I eggs. Use a whisk to uh, break up uh, hotel eggs, like scrambled <laughs> eggs. <laughs> That's. Terrible. Is it? <laughs> it sounds terrible. Uh, I don't know. I don't know. It depends on if you're an egg person. Oh, Jack God. Jack says Osama bin Ladle. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, God. Garbage disposal or whisk? <sighs> I'm, I would be willing to hear alternate uh, opinions on this. Um, I had to vote for whisk because, like, what would make me the most happiest for me to win? <laughs> <laughs> Even though technically garbage disposal in my day-to-day -day life makes me happiest. Little Demon says, oh, I'm Flynn. I don't, I don't chat. I don't know who I can trust. Sorry, it's hard for me. Random person likes to blame my parents. I just blame myself for being dumb. You're fine, dude. Like, uh, like be as shy as you need to be to yeah, feel cool. Yeah, no, like, it sounds disingenuous and like, oh, I'm just making it up because, you know, I'm the person running the stream. Some of but, my best friends are shy. Yeah. No, no. Like, I honestly understand. If I was like, if our positions were switched, I would be like you. And yeah, I could, I, I, I know at this point I can blame it on my parents. Like my mom especially. But, but, uh, here, one sec. But no, I understand. Like, do what makes you feel comfortable, but also feel free to step outside of that comfort zone and uh, say hi. Like, as I said, we don't bite, and we want to make sure everyone, like, you know, feels welcome here. Unless you're an asshole. Like, and I'm... If you're friends with a random person, I know you're not an asshole. Yeah. Okay, now that the real talk is over, let's go back to being weird. Thick eyebrows versus pinky toe. <laughs> 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 Only in Jackbox games. Absolutely eyebrows, 100%. I love those. Oh, those fuck. No, eyebrows. I didn't I didn't read the prompt. Oh, I bet I'm the wrong one. Because thick, some thick eyebrows on certain people. It's Maisie Williams' best feature. Also, fucking Cedric, Cedric Diggory, his best feature. I guess you know, does, yeah. um, our yeah. pats. Yeah, you yeah, know, Robert Pattinson. You know, I had an interesting encounter with someone what? who I was pretty, I'm pretty sure who, <laughs> I don't think people want a large prostate. A large prostate means you got problems, dude. Yeah. Um, but 
I think there was a guy in high school who I think had a crush on me, but I was also like, I don't feel the same way, and it's kind of like, I don't know, like, uncomfortable with how you don't recognize I don't feel the same way, but he was saying that, like, I have big eyebrows, and like, oh, that's a European trait, it's like, cool. You're, you have big eyebrows, it's European traits, must be good for breeding. <laughs> right? I, I have, uh, like, uh, breeding hips. Um, uh, you do want a big heart, but you don't want an enlarged heart. Enlarged heart is bad. <laughs> Definitely knows. Yeah? Yeah. Oh, it didn't even give me a chance to pick. There's a lot of people with, who have, like, what you might call large noses that I think look great. Yeah, my uh, aunt actually, one of my aunts had a nose job because, you know, she had a Jewish nose. But there's nothing wrong with the Jewish nose. I know, right? Okay, I'm going to have to <clears throat> vote against me. Thick eyebrows all the way. Pink, big pinky toes? Oh, you don't want that. That'll, that'll fuck you up. Let's see. Um, Zero Jui says hello. Hello. Hi Hopefully there. I said that correctly. Uh, there's a lot happening in the chat that I can't keep up with because I'm uh -oh. playing the game. Don't hate the player. Hate the game. Yeah. Thick eyebrows. The one that I didn't bet towards because I didn't read the fucking prompt. <laughs> we Landslide. can't all win so that's okay uh, isn't pp the same yes oh you won't want a large pancreas though right um i don't know yeah i don't know what 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 happens if you get a large pancreas i don't know <laughs> Lots of people are changing sides. <laughs> yeah, I, sides. I I was about to change sides too, and it's like I don't know. I don't know, man. I don't do biology. Oh, biology! I was thinking of the biology. same thing. <laughs> At first, I went to that reproduction song from Greece too, and then best nickname for hitman. Okay. Oh, I I still have to go with thick eyebrows, man. Oh my god. That would be a great name for a hitman. Zero Zwi is how you say it. Okay. Okay. Um, let's see. Uh, scroll up, scroll up. Oh boy, there's a lot. There's so much. Many, many <laughs> multi-line <laughs> oh, things. There's a many thing. Okay, um, well, after this game, we'll figure out what's what. Yeah, we'll we'll spend a minute reading the chat. Yeah, back. so hold on, hold on, guys. Uh, chill, I mean, chill the fuck out. I mean, keep talking, but uh, yeah. yeah uh, so. Uh, tell me more, tell me more. I'm going Nose. Nose is a better name for a hitman. Yeah. Yeah, because penis is like, what are you, uh, five? Did you know the word penis at five? I don't know, I'm sure some people did. I didn't. I don't know. Like, I literally cannot remember. I don't, I, I think I just said thing. Thing. Yeah, for a really yeah. long time, and then I watched uh, some movie where somebody said dick, and I just said dick for the rest of my life. I see. Yeah, thick eyebrows would be great for a hit hitman. Now, how how embarrassing would it be to be killed by a guy named Peepee? <laughs> that that would suck, honestly. It's like Tarbuck, you voted for PP? Yeah, I thought there was no way, given the maturity of most people on the internet, that PP would lose. The most impressive body part to be able to shred on with a to use your <laughs> to use to play guitar, nose or eyebrows, which I, was more impressive. Use eyebrows, this to play guitar. Obviously, eyebrows. eyebrows yes. Yeah, like a nose. I can see that. No, you guys are fucking wrong. Yeah. No, Pic no. Picture somebody shredding on bass with their eyebrows. Yeah, that's that's just insanity. Okay, come on. Eyebrows, eyebrows for the win. Eyebrows. Nose! But you were on eyebrows! Yeah, my phone was, like, not updating properly as no! it was going. So it would only, like, I would hit it three times... And it would only flash once. I think it's because of my screen protector being fucky. No, ugh, God, no. Koa, you don't win. Ugh, 
Oh no, Koa doesn't win. Jazz wins. Oh, congratulations! But no, Ko Koa, you did not win that one. <laughs> uh, I I dispute. Uh, we're going to court. I'll see you in court, bro. <clears throat> okay. My Jasper. I feel like playing the game again. Um, here, let me go um, ahead and. Uh, well, don't don't we want to? Yeah, yeah, we're gonna. But first, let me just. Okay. Uvox. Okay, okay, as long as I'm number one, that's fine. Okay, now we can get back into the chat. Like, uh, I just wanted to, like, set it up so people can play again. Uh, so then, yeah, they have something to do while we're reading the chat. And getting caught. Tibic. I'm TBK Euphonium. I love it. I also love your avatar. I, I wish we could pick him because I would pick that one every single time. <laughs> yeah, you know he's got a thick, uh, like Eastern European accent. Yeah. Okay. All right. Shall we tab back over for oh, for sure, convenience yeah. sake? Yeah. Let's go ahead and tab over and. All oh right. God. So There's... where are we at? So we're here. <laughs> okay, uh, Flynn, you're not dumb. Please learn that. Agreed. Uh, man, yeah, writing a convincing Jibberty kid would be tough. Jibberty, uh, Jibberty, Jibberty. I was thinking Liberty's kids, but I don't know. Um, okay. Parents suck. Yes, they do. Uh, happy to have you. <laughs> Parents suck. Yes, they do. Parents suck. How about you? <laughs> Rain music note. Hello. Uh, I have a love-hate relationship with the Degrassi subreddit. There are a lot of good writers, but one person will post a take and five other people will decide to make the same post after that yeah and like it's not even like right after that but it's like i see the same takes all the time on the degrassi subreddit they kind of like cycle through and then it's like i get it. like there's only a finite number of takes that you can have about a show but it's also like i don't does it always have to be the worst ones just saying i mean it's not always the worst takes on the degrassi subreddit but I feel like oftentimes it is enough to where I don't want to be on there. Chicken Mage, I don't think I honestly have, uh, I don't know. Mm -hmm, let me take a drink and then we'll. I feel Jeopardy Kid would be most similar to the Emma Shane episode in season three, but would be very shoehorned and fan servicey. I don't know. Like. It would definitely be extremely fan service -y because, you know, of course, only fans would want to see it. Honestly, though, I don't think there's any reason to, ha to like, you know, follow Liberty's kid. Like, they're all the way in Washington, I think, so it's like, what's the point? Like, um, random purse, uh, Cutter Circle says, do you, uh, like, hate, or are meh, Ray, with my contribution to the subreddit? Oh, okay, that's to someone else. Um, random person is my only friend. We can't meet because my parents refuse to let me meet an LGBT friend I met online. I'm not out to my parents if it isn't obvious. Uh, I will be quiet. I don't want to make the stream sad. No, it's okay. It's okay, man. Um, I understand. Like, yeah, parents suck and it sounds like your parents suck too. Especially if they won't, like, they won't facilitate you being able to, like, it, it, not just like oh they won't facilitate you meeting an online friend because a lot of parents are like that but you know they might have good reasons for it but it's more like they sound like they suck because they make you feel like you're unable to be out to them and that's bad that is legitimately terrible um freaky friday was a trip yes it was faith uh it's okay, f uh, Flynn. Vamp is my favorite YouTuber, and I told you why. Oh, well, thank you. Oh. <laughs> um, open, di open Discord real quick. What's up? Look at my cat. Oh, my cat's gone. Cat. What's going on in Discord? All right, so uh, go over to the Arch Discord. Uh -huh. Now, um, depending on what it is, the picture that you want us to want to, us to see, if it's a vamp picture, put it in the not a vampire crypt. Or, or if it is art that you made, put it in arch art. If it's art that you made that is not to do with us, then put it in art. If it's just something funny, put it in meme and such. Um, that's a lot of things. Like here, what's the what's just the put message? It, like um, trinket mage. Uh, 
Uh, Twilight Moon says, is Vamp Tarbuck, if there's something Degrassi related I want to show you, it's a picture. Okay, if it's Degrassi related, just put in uh, vamp- not Vampire Crypt. There we go. Just Yes. Let's just uh, put that right there. If it's Degrassi related, put it in there. Uh, yeah. Okay, so yeah, that sounds cool. <laughs> also, you like that flash of politics on the screen? <laughs> yeah, right? Uh, uh, we'll, we'll get to that later. Yeah, um, that's that is on its way. Jasper, I feel shooting horned. Yes, uh, I feel like if make him DM of the series, have the family move to Degrassi and have him find out that's where his birth mothers and father were from. Maybe. I don't, I don't know. I don't know. Oh, shit. Uh, it, it, it jumped. Okay, there we go. Okay. I just sneezed. Lamau. Congratulations. Uh, Faith says it's better for young children to know the actual terms. I agree. Yes, It's exactly. not very common, but it is better. What scary episodes of Degrassi should we be watching for Halloween? Um, we could watch that one, uh, the, the, the mini-sode series, uh, where, like, they're all, like, different, like, I don't know, spookiness. I don't know. I don't know. I'll have to look into it, because I haven't seen it in a while. Sincerely Mean says, good evening. Hello! Oh, no, 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 more like, good evening. More like that. That's how I read it. Good evening. I am the maven of the even tide, and welcome, welcome to, to Vampire, Vampire Reviews. Reviews. We're I, nerds. I would prefer if the Emma of the series had parents of alumni rather than being one of the kids put up for adoption, TBH. When opposed, uh, Jibberty kid showing up, though. Mm. I Yeah, I kind of agree. Like, I'd rather... It, it would have been great if it was uh, Jack Simpson. Like, it's it's it feels like a stupid meme, annoying thing to me now. Like how everyone's like, oh, they got to like redo like uh, reboot to Cassie with Jack Simpson. But honestly, I do agree that would have been a great option if they would have been able to do like capitalize on that at the time. Yep. Uh, let's see. You're good, fam. Early D. TNG was filled with OG crossovers would be wrong for next generation rival not to do the same. Yeah. Yay, I beat Vamp. Grrr. <laughs> I'm watching you cut our historical. I remember some zombie episodes, but I think those were mini episodes. Yeah, basically. Faith is Koa? Whoa. Whoa, <laughs> whoa, 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 whoa. I did not see that coming. Uh, Nowhere to Run is great scary movie parody episode. You're right. That's the one. Yeah, you're right, Jasper. Yep. Uh, still holding out hope for a uh, reboot soon. Baby Jack has been character. Yep, just addressed that. Uh, what streaming software do you use? Streamlabs, OBS? OBS. I've thought, like, I've heard people talk about Streamlabs. I've never looked into it, though. Yep. <clears throat> um, we also to have Angie come back. I think uh, Angie's time's already passed, unfortunately. Vamp and Tarbuck, there's something to grasp. Okay, yeah, we just talked about it, so we'll check the Discord in a moment. Wish I knew how to make videos and to edit. Um, uh, sail the high seas and get, uh, like, uh, what's the streaming software that you want us to start using? Um, the streaming software? Or, no, 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 the video, uh, like, Premiere or something? No, no, yeah, Adobe Premiere. Adobe Premiere. We like, use. sail the high seas and get Adobe Premiere and, uh, look up tutorials on that. Um, it, you, if you use the most recent version of um, uh, Vegas, that's fine. Uh, you should still pirate it because do that. But if you don't feel like pirating it, they recently made it cheaper because oh. Sony sold it off to a different company. Oh, shit. Yeah. But, yeah, uh, basically get it's like a 40 bucks editing platform and just learn how to use it. Like, it's... There is a learning curve. I will say that. Like, it feels second nature to me to use Sony Vegas now because, you know, I've been using it for years. But it just, just one of those things where it's like you just got to get up and do it, basically. Um, let's see. Uh, do, 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 do. Flynn's parents are a certain person in the White House fans. Oh, honestly, that's not surprising. Even yeah. more reason to say fuck them. Yeah, let's not dis- discuss their dumbness. <laughs> uh, yeah, I, I, I feel that. Um, I feel like wish. Angie would. I don't Have think they said con- hi to uh, Chucky Bo- Bob Bobville. Hello. I feel like Angie would have enough con- uh, connection to D and but is vague enough to not cause much shakeup. You wouldn't need to bring back Alex Steele. They didn't bring uh, Shane Zoji actor. In. I, honestly, though, like. 
Angie has aged out of high school by this point. That's just that's just a fact of it. Uh, she, she honestly should have come back when, like, if she was going to come back at all, it should have been when Tori, a.k.a. Alex Steele, came in. But she didn't, so I think that's just dead. Post on Discord. I'm Blake. Cool. We'll check it out shortly. Oh, quality shortened to Koa. That's great. Time yeah. stands still allegedly was on Halloween day. I call BS. I getcha. Uh, like, okay. I don't know. I, I wasn't there for it, so, like, I don't know. Uh, Team Bjergsen, I'm broke. Well, that's why we say pirate. No, I'm saying bring her back as a teacher at the school, not a student. Mmm. I don't know. Maybe. I don't know. I don't know if people will have enough attachment to Angie as a character to be like see her as a student and be like or as a teacher and be like, oh my god! I feel like Marco would better fill that role because we saw him in his student teacher position. Hmm. Little demon joined the Discord. Okay, cool. Nice. Nice. Oh you're <laughs> right. Okay. Okay. I get it. I get it. <laughs> yeah, they are are they wearing the same okay, it's not at least it's not the same gray beanie. At least that. But, you know, as a person who appreciates gray beanies, spot on. Alright, I think we're ready to go ahead and say everyone's in. Let's get this game started. Awesomest grandma names. Um, oh, oh, okay. That was just a tutorial. We don't need a tutorial because we, we already saw how this goes. Okay. Prompt is scariest name for a babysitting service. Hmm. Hmm. This is tough. I don't know. That's the first thing I thought of. I couldn't think of anything better. Mm. Okay, let's see. Time to make some bets. I'm gonna go for that. Stop playing with your flashlight. But I love it. I can tell, but you're like a fucking obsessed. Bah. Bah. That's you. There we go. That's the best I got. Yeah. I don't know what you got though. Babysitter, the babysitters club or murder teens. This is a difficult one. I'm gonna say murder teens. Like, Baby Series Club, it's like, oh, that's charming, it's like the book! Books, I should say. Does anyone remember Baby Series Club? I mean, she, I mean, like, only people, like, our age and older would, wouldn't they? Um, I guess, yeah. Because they were, like, you know, uh, kind of old by the time I was... We sit on your kids... Break a few eggs. What the fuck? I gotta go break a few eggs because it's not outright, but it's also like, what? <laughs> <laughs> oh, Smackdown. Oh, God. Faith says, my older sister read those books. Yeah. Sincerely Me says, I love graphic novels. Graphic novels are the fucking best. Like, one of the things I want to do, um, like, as I move to this job that should hopefully pay me more than my current job does, is I want to get more fucking graphic novels, because I love them. Hold on, one second. I need to vote for uh, this one. Um, like, graphic novels are great. Like, and I'm not just saying that because I have reading comprehension issues and therefore can't read regular novels. <laughs> Which is true, but, like, graphic novels are great. 
Manga specifically is cool, but you know, other graphic novels, great. Hey. If anything has a graphic novel version, I'll always read that first. That's frankly how I read um, like classics such as uh uh d um, mm, fuck I can't hold on. Baby Takers, I love it. Uh 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 God, what's it called? Les Misérables. That's how I read Les Misérables because I read the graphic novel version mm -hmm. and the audio book was fucking boring. I mean, how did I ever get through Hunchback of Notre Dame? That was even worse. Because Hunchback of Notre Dame, it's like... Uh, it's, it's about Notre Dame. It's, it's not 30, about the plot. It's it's 30% uh, plot and like 70% uh, history of Paris and Notre Dame. And that's... Uh, it, is, it is such a slog to get through, I'll tell you that. Yep. Wait, oh, I didn't vote. Okay, I'm going for that one. Okay, but yeah, it's like, it's such a slog to get through, and I don't know. I mean, it's kind of worth it so then I can see what it originally was, but still. Nah, I'm going for break a few eggs. That's, that's scary, because it's like, why is that your, your, the name of your... Why are you called that? <laughs> yeah, what, what does that have to do with it? What's going on? Oh, uh, but I guess I lost. Murder teens. Anybody, Murder teens. Anybody remember Nancy Drew? I yes. Fired and I missed. I fired again. And, and I, I missed, missed again. I missed. Yeah, Nancy Drew. I I know it existed, but I never like read the books or anything. Ah. Uh, uh, no one likes mine. Bleh. Sad. Where? No, don't give me the pity vote. Uh, take back your pity vote, you fools. <laughs> oh no, it's a tie and I can't defend it. I I can't do it. Uh, Scooter, help me. I'm too drunk for this. Yeah. I'm trying as hard as I can. Yes! For the win! Why are you looking at me like that? I voted for you out of pity. <laughs> no, no, I told you not to do that, you fool! Yo, boxcar children. I would totally read boxcar I, children. I've heard of boxcar children, uh, Hardy Boys. Hardy Boys, similar, similar concept. Yeah. Um. I only know these things existed. I never actually read them. I think we had some Babysitter's Club books uh, um, in my house growing up because they probably came from my older sisters, but oh, I never read them. I remember the first Boxcar Children book being so different from all the others. Oh, really? Yeah. Scary were... Oh, Murder Teens 1? I wasn't paying attention. Congratulations, Faith. <laughs> I guess you earned it. Sabrina the Teenage Witch... Oh, I watched the original show. How original? Uh, well, I don't know. The 90s show. Which 90s show? Which? Which? The one with Melissa Joan Hart? I don't know. The one where Salem talked and he was funny. That's all of them. I Salem don't know. is consistently the best character. I don't know. What was it live the... action? Yes. Then that's the correct one. Okay. How do you spell cauliflower? Uh, no, it's okay. I got one. I got another one. How do you spell broccoli? Shit! Um. Okay, I'm going with that one. Fuck! Someone put in broccoli? I hate you! <laughs> no, no, no. Wait, wait, wait. No, no, no. Let me change it. Let me change it. Why did it... I'm trapped. Your, your phone is freaking out. I f I f because I freaked out. That's why. I guess... Most sensual vegetable. <laughs> I mean, cauliflower and broccoli are really good for that. Sensual. What the fuck's a kumquat again? It's a fruit. So why is it in the vegetables? Because being a vegetable, like, f fruit is a subset of vegetable. Not culinarily, but like, Scooter like disagrees. In, in terms of botany. Scooter disagrees. <clears throat> well, I guess I don't have an entry for this one. Okay, what's up with the chat? Want to read an Archie comic and I'm jealous. Random person has so many. Huh. What about that? Um, I wonder if they're 
posted online. They probably are. In fact, uh, Chuckle Bob Phil says, uh, check online. There's some awesome trades you can get. Yeah. I'm not allowed to read comic books because it's wasting. That's not true. It is not a waste of intelligence. Not even close. No, they are not a waste of intelligence. Like, honestly, like, it still it does still use your brain to, like, you know, animate the uh, panels in between them. Yeah. Perfectly legitimate. Yeah, I hate, I don't like, I don't like it when people say that uh, comic books are hey. le- a lesser form of reading. I mean, again, partially because I have, uh, uh, like, a vested interest in comics, but also because, like, there's just no reason to think that way. Like, it's just another form of storytelling. Hmm. I have to go for the lettuce here. I went for the potato squash because I don't see how lettuce could be essential. But it's like leafy. I don't, I don't know. I yeah, think. no, no. I only voted for kale because I didn't. I didn't think the other one was. I mean, is there any competition? Apparently, there is. Okay. This is fascinating. Yeah. What the fuck's a rutabaga, anyways? I don't remember. All these non-American vegetables. Nobody said aubergine. What the fuck's an aubergine? It's an eggplant. I've never even heard of it before. Yes, you have on the procrastinators. When? Um, they talked about it with, with Gib. I don't, I don't remember this, so it didn't happen. <laughs> oh, this um. cat. Oh, I wish I could share the scooter with the world, but I also am glad that she's mine. Yep. Most of the bad for your intellect things, people don't base that on anything. They just are making it up based on whether they like it or not. Yeah, exactly. Like, people said that about books. Like, books in general way back when. And they say it now about video games. Like, hey, stop playing those video games that engage your problem-solving abilities. And uh, you should instead, um, you should instead, you know, fucking... Read a book, just, watch a movie. Just watch this movie, which will just beam content at you that you don't even have to pay attention to. Yeah. It's it's really stupid. Like, no one's basing this off of research or anything. It's just like, oh, that's the new thing, so it has to be bad. Stop playing that puzzle-solving game that, like, keeps your attention and, like... and Yeah, or, or stop playing, and stop playing this instead, game that encourages you to have wit. You should instead watch uh, Family Guy. That's yeah. what you should do instead. Just just, just let it drain you. Woo, broccoli! The one that I wanted to put in, but then someone else put in. So that's cool. Broccoli versus... Okay, we're gonna find out. I mean, it has to be eggplant. There's no way it could be kale. Nobody likes kale. It's bitter. I liked kale at one point. No, you didn't. Yes, I did. I tried it in high school, and I was like, you know, I hate this, but it's also good. What was good about it? I don't know. It just had a charm to it. I just kept eating it. Like, like what? I don't know. It was in <laughs> high school. <laughs> Eggplant versus broccoli? Honestly, uh, no contest. Right. Totes agree. Someone, someone picked right with eggplant. It's a, I guess it's a landslide. I guess we'll find out who it was. Ran, you did it, didn't you? Okay, I see, I see, I see. Random person. Where the wind goes sweeping down the plains. And the wave and weave uh, it sure smells sweet when the wind comes right behind the <laughs> rain. Faith oh. won again. Wait, wait, it's not, we're not done yet, though. Shut up. We're not done yet. We're not done yet. Yeah. This is the one that I think is the most interesting. Yeah, this one's fun. Name any celebrity. Um. This one's my one of my favorites. I can't spell the name apparently. Actually, you okay. Know what? Thank God, no one picked it. Are we are we doing favorites? Sure. 
Well, I picked my favorite because I know shit about them. Okay. There we go. Oh, look at my scooter. On her soft fur that she keeps so clean and dainty. Oh, Faith I love her. Faith is allergic to eggplant. Oh, yeah. Faith is so gay, she's allergic to all dick-shaped foods. <laughs> oh, dear. Like eggplants and bananas. And squat? Uh, um, I, I forget about squash. Um, hmm. Who would want to fight with any kind of cheating allowed? I'm picking this one because yep. I have a vested interest in this one. <laughs> Twilight Moon says, I picked my favorite YouTuber. PewDiePie. Okay. I was going to say PewDiePie as well. <laughs> DJ Khaled and Robin Williams. Uh, Robin Williams. He would make uh, DJ Khaled uh, laugh too hard, which is how wacky he'll be. He seems like a think-out-of-the-box kind of dude. Yeah. Well, yeah. Have you, have you ever seen him? Faith like, is also allergic to cucumber. Oh, that's sad. Which I love cucumbers. Which means that she can't pickles, probably. I love cucumbers. That's sad. What? <laughs> oh, no. I I, I kind of have to vote for Kim because I would not win in a fight. I'm such a teddy bear. You guys are wrong. Um, You would lose in a fight, definitely. I, I, I would lose in any fight. I am... Oh God! I can't even. Uh, I can't even land a real blow because I'm just like, oh, oh, oh no. <laughs> oh no! I can't go against Robin Williams. No. He would crush you. He would because I wouldn't even start. Oh no! Not You're another in man. Here twice. <laughs> Can I abstain? <laughs> Vote. Oh. I'm going to have to vote Chris and Stewart, man. Although I really want to... I, I just want to see myself on there twice. It'd be fucking funny. <laughs> okay, yeah. Chris and Stewart deserve to win that one. Because mm -hmm. I can't... I can't, man. I just can't. I, I can't fight. Have you seen her lately? She's she's great. Oh, is she? Yeah. Cool. Glad to know. Although they did tell her that she'd only get a Marvel movie if she stopped being publicly gay. What? Yep. <gasps> oh, no! Scooter or Bill Nye? I don't know. Scooter seems like... Uh, Scooter lived on the streets yeah, back in yeah, the day. Yeah, yeah, Scooter was a street cat. She, She's no basic bitch. She knows how to take a fight. She knows how to put up a fight. Yeah, she she could throw down. Yeah. Also... It, the, it's going to be you versus Scooter in the end. Oh, no! That would be great. Anything to prop up my Scooter. Um... For people who don't follow this channel much, Scooter is our cat. Yeah, Scooter's m our beloved cat. Best and she's choice great. to date your mom. Oh, God, Scooter. Wait. No. No. Not Robin Williams or not a vampire. I don't want anyone to date my mom. <laughs> I mean, I guess me, because... No. I have to abstain. Would, would, you, would you date someone else's mom? No, it's not for me. I'm not. I'm not really into... Well, I don't know. I'm not really into older women. I'm, I'm like not the mel milf hunter type. No, I'm slightly more into. That was quick. Okay, I guess I have to vote for me because it's funny. Um, but like, I'm not. I like uh, slightly older guys, and I guess very slightly older women, but not too old. Like, I'm not looking for silver foxes here. Um, we were talking about something. Um, it's midnight again with five dollars. Says hello. Oh my God! Thank you very much. Hi there. Uh, scooter. <laughs> no, it has to be scooter. Kristen Stewart actually would date moms, though. Kristen would Stewart she? seems oh. like she would be. Would she? She could be a milf hunter. Oh yeah, I was saying, uh, fuck Hollywood for telling uh, Kristen Stewart that she has to be less gay. Yeah. Because that's that's stupid. Uh, Faith says pickles are nasty, but the pickling process changes the structure of the protein so that they won't cause a reaction. Hmm. Pickles are still good, though, I say. Do you not like the texture or the taste or both? Best choice is date my dad. <laughs> um. Scooter. Yeah, Scooter. Yeah, yeah, Def. Oh, no. Oh, no. It's a close call. I don't know. 
<laughs> but, but look at Scooter laying right there on your lap with that Dad Slayer energy. <laughs> oh, where did this round go? Oh my god. How did I end up winning but not winning? I think when Scooter wins, we all win. True, though. Oh, Faith wins! Oh, okay. Oh. I just knocked over my Coke. Cool. Oh god, okay. Uh, you... Uh. Uh. Here you go. Thank you. I'm being cool. Okay, we're gonna play a different game now. Uh, this is Story of a Girl. Who cried a river and drowned the whole world. And then, and then. Wait, no, no. Where am I going? What? No, no. I wanna, I wanna quit the game. No, I wanna quit the game. Yeah, back. Okay. Survive the internet was fun. Let's do survive the internet. Okay. Here, let me go ahead. Okay, I have to get my thing in first. Because I have to be the VIP... I hate not being the VIP, and it sounds so, like, uh, pretentious, but I have to be the veep. Okay. Okay, Vampersant has entered the building. Vampersant! In, in the meantime, let's go ahead and have a look at this. Um, what a ridiculous thing to say. Ooh, I'd love to join. Sincerely me. Go ahead and join. Now's the time to join. Uh, let's see. Is there a gayness limit she's exceeding? Either way, screw them. Uh, more gay, the better. That's all I say. Yes, more gay is better. Do you have FSX? I don't even know what that is. My parents are coming. I'll be right back uh, so I don't get in trouble. Do what you gotta do, little demon. Like, take care of yourself. Do what you gotta do. Can I get out on this one, says Trinket Mage? Yes, and please do. Oh, Oh, I think we got we have too many players. Oh, only eight players for this one. Shit. Okay. Uh, let's see. I find it hard to believe that Kristen Stewart was told she had to stop being publicly gay simply because they haven't told anyone else. They haven't told anyone else that, and they have several LGBT plus actors and actresses in their movies. I don't know. I honestly don't know. I'm not saying she wasn't. Just saying it's hard to believe. Flight Simulator X. Uh, no, I don't have that. I just still, I'm not really sure what that is. Okay, I'm gonna say everyone's in because apparently, like, we can only have eight people, so here we go. Also, Faith, I love that you're back to Autourney. That is my favorite one. <laughs> Autourney is great. Yeah, you guys, remember, you guys can join the audience at any time, and you'll be playing along in a sort of way where you're, like, voting along with us. You can kick me to open a spot for someone else. No. I'm not going to do that, Faith. Uh, would let them parents deal with me when they're angry. Okay. We're going to skip the tutorial. It's basically the same thing as um, uh, what bracketeering was. Basically, uh, say something that you think is going to be funny and then it gets turned into something even funnier. Okay, something you would tell your younger self. Apparently this game only takes eight people, so... Gotcha. I'm cool with that. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna take dishes downstairs. Okay. Flint's parents aren't good people when angry. Yeah, they, sound, they don't sound like good people at all. Honestly. Internet kicked me anyway, Lamau. Oh, that sucks! Also, I apologize if my comments came off as rude. Never my intent. Um... I don't know, they didn't come off as rude. I just, I just honestly don't know. Um, if only actors had skill acting, they can let them act like characters are playing. Yeah, it's silly how people are like, 
I don't know. Like, they want certain public personas along with acting ability. I don't, I don't know. Eh. You know, I'm a little too drunk to get into this conversation, honestly, so I'm gonna not. Okay, um... Oh, there was a question a while ago as to whether or not we have Netflix. Only until the end of the month. Okay. And, uh, put my answer in. Yeah, basically. I I used to use Netflix, but I, just, I honestly just don't anymore. You never reach for it, so no reason no, to have it. No. Like, I only reach for it when I'm on my iPad, and it's like, I'm just bored. <clears throat> Even then, I only use it for scrolling through movies and seeing things that, oh, maybe I'll want to watch at one point, but that's about it. You know what I use it for? Hmm. She-Ra. Party murder trivia game. What the fuck? You know, their most popular game. Watching Degrassi now, the breakaway episode. What, what, what episode is that? I don't know the episodes by their names very well. Like, I know some of the famous ones, but not that one. Uh, ask Vamp uh, Vampire something. How should I get over my depression and interpersonal problems? Have like any self esteem? <laughs> honestly though, <laughs> honestly though, are you athletic? No, I'm no LeBron James. <laughs> yeah, I get you. I get you. What if I cry the river and drown the whole world? I'd say you're bad, but that you don't deserve that. <laughs> <laughs> okay. No, fuck you. Hashtag fuck train, uh, Trump train, uh, debt to boys, fuck libs. Fuck you, Trump. Uh, okay. Eh, meh. Meh. Something you can't say to your significant other to avoid an argument. I thought I saw a patty cat. What? Uh, <laughs> I kinda got it. I kinda got it, yeah. Thought. What cutter is about fantasy games? Pretty sad and bored. Oh. <laughs> Oh. Spending too much on fantasy stuff. Oh, yowch. Yikes. If you could only say one thing, what would it be? Divorce. Oh! <laughs> um, Blake, are you okay? <laughs> okay, um... I have to I have to vote for this one. It's just too funny. Like there's two of them that really stand out and it's like oh god, I have to vote for this one. God. Okay, I gotta see who wins this one. Um Well it's breakaway part two actually. Uh the episode where people think Claire got a boob job. Oh, that's a classic. I tell you, a classic. I, yeah, yeah, the one that Jasper uh, like did... What? Just from context, I feel like I understand what happened in that episode. Yeah, yeah, people uh, thought Claire got a boob job when actually she got her, uh, like, got laser eye surgery. And so she's like, you fucking kidding me? No one is noticing that I'm not wearing my glasses anymore. <laughs> <laughs> Ah, That's it, way better than what I thought. Yeah, it's great. It's great. Uh, Takes off glasses. Did you, oh, I love did that you one for a, being a Le Wesley episode. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Let's see. Write a brief review of the last party you attended. Honestly, I can't. Fuck! No! I did it again! <laughs> I can't play anymore! What happened? So, on the bottom right hand of my screen, there's a trash can button that clears my entire browser. Why? Because Firefox Focus, that's why. Okay. 
God, I'm going to the bathroom. Entertain the masses hey, in my guys. stead. Oh shit! Oh shit! Oh, I'm. I, oh god, no. Ah. Um. Well, that sucks. Uh, so how's everybody doing? If I eated soap, I did because I didn't. No, I didn't. month away from being 26 and I, and I just realized this morning I have way more like brown like dimply spots on my face when did that happen I don't know fuck I didn't close the door I don't know that's your yeah. problem now what's what's going on my f what yeah but I'm just gonna be in the audience now hey remember in like uh what was it? Uh, sometime after, like, Claire and Eli met, and, like, they were in, like, a, uh, like, doing online, like, instant messenger. Man, those were the days, weren't they? I mean, I was alive for them, but I didn't participate in them. Vacuum cleaner, 3,000! There were lots of snacks. It was fun. What? <laughs> what? Kit Kat. It was full of parents. What? I don't follow. Me either. Poster of Faith Hill. Well, the BDSM was really overpowered. Any wholesomeness. I don't know. There's wholesome... No, maybe there's not. Cried so hard. Onions. <laughs> oh, no. Long and annoying cumbersome. 45 inch giant dildo. Yeah, agreed. Completely satisfactory, but I felt cold afterwards. Jump a pack of saltine crackers. Oh, ordinary college. Trump University. Uh, no, nah, Trump University is even worse. Cause like, well, at it, least you're... you can get any degree from any other university. I uh, liked it, but unfortunately, the cat shredded it. Rested wicker basket, basically. Basically. Okay, what should I vote for? This one's just too out there, so I have to go for it. Hmm. What's I'm looking to see what what we missed in chat. Uh, glad to hear you're safe, uh, Flynn. Uh, hopefully that means somewhere you said you were safe, so that's good. I'm glad to hear. If I eat it soap. I did it because I didn't. No, I didn't. <laughs> yep. <laughs> what the fuck? Uh, <laughs> uh, Bam, try rejoining. Unfortunately, yeah. Oh, you rejoined and you weren't in the audience? That's weird. I, I ended up in the audience, so yeah, unfortunately I can't. I've heard enough t uh, time in this... I have a hard time enough thinking of good answers, let alone that while also entertaining the masses. Yeah. This is ba like doing Jackbox games on my streams is basically like free content. Like I'm just I'm getting content from you guys for free. Yeah. To give to like pay out to the masses. Uh someone keeps going hard on Trump answers. Yeah, well it's kind of all consuming when you're around it all the time. I I yeah. understand that. Like um, yeah, I try not to, like, think a lot about it, but, you know, with the election coming up and then, God, living in Indiana and seeing Trump posters everywhere. God, there was Trump uh, graffiti on one of the cement blocks on the corner from our place. And I have to see it every day because I drive right by there. 
Like, shit. Ugh, just, ugh, it makes me so miserable, you know? Politics makes me miserable. I mean, at least the nice lady who seems nice from New Zealand got a second term. You know, in New Zealand, they seem to be doing okay. Hmm. <clears throat> so at least someone's doing okay around these parts. I know parts. nothing of international politics. New Zealand seems to be doing really good with uh, containing COVID. In fact, um, um, so they contained COVID and there weren't any new cases. And then when there were suddenly new cases in one of their uh, cities, they like went full lockdown mm -hmm. and got rid of it again. Cool. Yeah. And yeah. Oh, good for them. Yeah. New Zealand seems to be doing pretty well for themselves. Indiana's a terrible state. I live here too. Ah, oh, that sucks. Oh, uh, yeah. Uh, sorry you live here. Yeah. Jesus. I'm hiding in my closet because my dad's mad and arguing with my mom. Oh, God, I know that feeling. Yeah. I, I would go to, like, the basement or my room whenever my parents were arguing. Like, I have such trauma from that that when I was working in Chicago, oh, years ago now, but, um... And my, the president of my company, basically my boss and, uh, the, uh, vice president or whatever, like when they were like starting to argue right above me, like, so there was this, uh, like swirly staircase right above me. So I could hear into the conference room as they argued. I just ran from my desk to the basement to like, you know, get away from it. Like, mm -hmm. fuck what's going down. Mm -hmm. Didn't want to be around it. So I completely understand, dude. Take care of yourself. Do what you gotta do, man. They're crafty! Mowing thoughts. What? <laughs> I don't follow. He's a powerful man who has some flaws. Trump is Oh, that racist. makes you look pretty bad. Yeah, that does make you look terrible. Daddy... F oh, um... Mm, I don't even want to read that out. Yeah, no. Honestly. Well, they're gone. Sorry. <laughs> oh, that's <laughs> terrible! Oh my god. There's a winner. New year, new look, new page. Hashtag dot dot dot. Oh, but that's iconic. Spoons. It seemed like the only way to eat. Mouth wide open. I mean, I guess. <laughs> Unless it's sumo, I hate it. Shredded wheat. What? <laughs> oh, I don't get it. Me neither. Uh, just no. I'd rather fall down the stairs. <laughs> oh no! I, I hear you, bro. A scooter scooting in her layer box. I have to go for a uh, random per the random person one. Oh my god, that was that's terrible. <laughs> well, they're gone. Sorry. Like oh oh no. Huh. Let's see, where were we? Oh, I need to get Scooter some water. Oh, get her some water. Oh, I didn't realize. Oh, I feel like a terrible cat parent. The latest Gus Johnson video on New Zealand was amazing. Who's Gus Johnson? I've never heard of him. 68% uh, of Canada hates the U.S. because of Trump. My opinion also. Uh, is so is so so. Yeah, my understanding is that uh, Canada's not a huge U.S. fan lately. Which, uh, not, not, no, I don't, I don't disagree with. Oh, God, I'm sorry to hear that. Uh, please stay safe. Yeah, agreed. Michiana, Michigan slash, uh, Indiana border, represent. Yep. Michiana, Michiana, Michiana? Yeah. Michiana. Yeah. I don't know why I can't figure out how to say it now. But, yep. Michiana represents... I got kicked ages ago, so anything being attributed to Alterney at the moment is not me, FYI. Yeah, same. Anything being attributed to not vampire as well. Or, uh, what did I say? An uh, vampersant? Yeah, vampersant. Uh, not me either. I live in Florida. Yeah. Yeah, that's uh, not a great place to be either. There, there's only a couple states where our, where it's be it's decent, at least, to be. But Indiana and Florida are not that. Um, there are no blue states, only blue counties. Yeah, basically, like, like, uh, living in the Chicagoland area, like, roughly blue county-ish, but, like, 
go like a decent what like go like at least like to, to an, show, an hour and a half outside of Chicago, you're back in Red County. Hmm. There's a map that shows what I mean. Yeah. I mean asked for my opinion on their argument and I don't know what to say, so my dad slammed the door in my face. Yeah, that's honestly not okay. I am entirely with random person. Your parents are assholes. They should not be turning to you for like advice or commentary on their arguments. That yep. is not your place. You are their child. Y it's not your responsibility to no. live their lives for them. No. They're supposed to be the adults here. They're supposed to be the ones the ones guiding you into what's right and wrong. This is fucking bullshit. God. I'm getting like flashbacks from my own parents and like my mom like complaining about my dad to me for like you know uh minutes on end like you know because like she didn't really have any other stress relief but it's also like i don't know it's like she she wasn't a great person either and it's like you don't deserve this you you don't deserve this flynn okay or um, little demon you don't you don't deserve this we uh you, we, you we probably, escaped our situation and you can escape yours. It will yeah. take a little while, but you can do it. You can get out of it. Believe and me, bro. For the first few years, like after you get out of it, you're probably gonna feel like you're fine. That everything's okay. And you have nothing to go to therapy about, but honestly Go anyway. Go anyways, yes. Like it honestly, that's the best advice I could have given my younger self, because like when I got out of my family situation, I needed therapy. I didn't think I did because, you know, I felt happier than I did it in the most, most of my life. But I needed therapy. Alright, uh, box fort. Yes! Uh, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that is kind of funny. Ice cream cone? First ice cream since quarantine. Fuck that Rona bitch. Agreed. Fuck that, Rona, bitch. Racing into Canada to sketch. Oh, shit. Somebody's got a one Trump mind. My office for the day. Oh. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Yeah, a lot of people's offices for the day, yeah. And I took the road less traveled. Appreciate the literary reference. I dig it. Yeah. J'appreche. Well, looks like I'm gonna burn a bunch of stuff tonight. Oh my god! No! About to put some ranch on this, <laughs> if you know what I mean. What? <laughs> what? Steak and ranch? No. I mean, I can, I can see it. Somebody knows how to push my buttons. <laughs> I, I appreciate uh, that. Uh, I'm going to go with this one because uh, this one's like, oh, no. Man, I appreciate that literary reference back to middle school. Yeah, I... <laughs> okay, okay. <laughs> Asshole. Right. Nobody actually reads like stuff like that just on their own. True. For, for example, have you ever read The Scarlet Letter on purpose? No, because <laughs> I hated it in, in uh, high school. I exactly. hated it. Exactly. I, 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 I thought it was cool, but... Uh, I kind of want to read Sylvia Plath because it's a thing that all depressed people read. And also because, like... Because it's I, a thing that all depressed people read. I liked read. one of her poems, and I tried to read her other poems, but I didn't get it. And I feel like there's something I'm just not getting that I should be getting. And that's my issue with poetry. I'm just too dense for it. Absurdism? No, it's not absurdism. It's just, like, it's too much, like, metaphor and, like... Uh, obfuscation that I just don't get it. Well, I don't know about you, but I never met a four I didn't like. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay, okay. Alright, I think we're gonna get out of uh, this one. But I don't... Uh, winner was Ah. Congratulations. Okay, let's Congratulations, see. Ah. Let's get caught up on the... Um, Flynn, been there myself. Uh, don't feel like you have to... Run to the end of the earth. Uh, just stay safe. Yeah. I agree. Uh, I agree with Chuck. Do what you have to do right now to stay safe. And then when the time comes, do what you have to do to get away from that situation. Like, it's going to feel like you have to be tied to your parents in some way because, like, you owe them or they can't make it without you. But honestly, 
for your own safety, you got to take care of yourself. You just have to. That's, at the end of the day, like, it, it's so <clears throat> individualist and asshole-ish sounding, but you have to take care of number one before you can take care of anyone else. Um, let's see. My mom threw a laundry basket at me because she saw Tristan and Miles kiss. That's terrible. That's fucking terrible, Jax. I'm out of steam, so I'm going to go sit down. Okay. Uh, Flynn, they really shouldn't be dragging you into their argument. I'm sorry you deal with this. Just hang on. Things will get better. Just know people do care about you. I don't know you, but I care. Yeah, I agree with Twilight Moon. Like, I don't know you do, but I care. And I'm sure basically everyone in the stream cares too. Like, we want to make sure you're safe. And we want to, you know, at least verbally be able to, like, support you and say that it can get better. You just, you could just gotta get out of the situation. It doesn't feel like you can at this point, but you will be able to eventually. Like, the day will come. Uh, honestly, when I was, like, you know, turning 18, I thought I was going to be tied to my mom forever. I thought I would always have to financially support her because she couldn't do it on her own. But then I got away. She moved to Iowa, and I moved to Indiana. And I've just... I've been working on myself ever since, and now I'm recognizing that I do need more to work on myself. Like, I do actually need real therapy to sort out all the things I went through when I was with her, but I'm not, I'm not trapped with her anymore. You can get to that point. What you know right now is not the be-all, end-all. Ranch is gross for sure. Uh, disagree. Hard disagree. Pizza on ranch? Yes. Applesauce on ranch? Yes. Uh, I remember my English teacher being mad at me for using an audiobook when we had to read The Scarlet Letter. Honestly, I might have appreciated it better if I used an audiobook because trying to read the pages of Scarlet Letter was confusing and I hated it. <laughs> uh, Jax, I won. How? I don't know. <laughs> No, Plath is just garbage. Ouch, Chuck. Okay. Okay. Youch. Um, I disagree, kind of. There's a Lola, um, God, I can't remember her channel's name, but there's a Lola something video about Sylvia Plath that I think... Ms. Lola. Yeah, Ms. Lola. Uh, that's, that's a channel. Talking about Sylvia Plath that I think would be good here. Um... I still have the scar, and the laundry basket's still in the house. Uh, I'm not allowed to watch the grassy because my parents say it's not realistic to the world. Um, I, uh, that is, that is bullshit, honestly. Yes, there are a little bit of, like, you know, sensationalist stuff because it is TV, but honestly, it's the most realistic show I've watched. Like, that's why I stand it so hard. That's why I keep making videos about it because it is so true to the human experience and keeps true to teenagers and what they go through. Your parents are just wrong. That That's the bluntest way I can put it. They're full of shit. Um, your parents must not really be paying attention if your parents think that. Yeah, agree. Uh, it's midnight again. Remember, the only thing you owe your parents is a loving handshake, a kind word, and pleasure of seeing your taillights when you get the chance. <laughs> I like how you put that. I didn't talk to my mother for 10 years, and we just recently started talking again. Now we can actually stand each other. You know, I think uh, something that some of you guys might appreciate um, is Jeanette McCurdy's podcast, Empty Inside. Um, if you remember, Jeanette McCurdy, she was on Nickelodeon, she played Sam on iCarly, and Sam on Sam and Cat, and she was involved in other things. Um, but she has this podcast right now uh, called Empty Inside, and she talks about a lot of these things, because she's been there. She grew up with a toxic parent who led her into such things like eating disorder disorders and other such issues. I think that might help to at least not feel alone but also have an idea of like there are ways to get better i mean that's kind of what i'm using it for right now i'm listening to it and i'm hearing her talk about her experience in therapy and it's like yeah 
okay, maybe therapy is not just some bullshit that people say to do and it never works. I think that'll help, a, like, a couple of you guys out there. Like, it's worth a, a look at. Especially if you're struggling with, you know, having, like, the effects of having a toxic parent. Even if you're not trapped with them right now. Um, little demon. Does she actually care about the Bible? Uh, splitting the Red Sea isn't likely to come up in the real world either. Yeah. Uh... Twilight Moon, uh, Degrassi covers real life experiences. It does. Joseph Polino, hello! Therapy is great. Yeah, and I wish I recognized that earlier. Because, like, I'm 99% certain I'm about to lose my health insurance. And I wish earlier on I would have, like, seriously tried to get into therapy. Like, hopefully with another thing, hopefully with this job, like, um, that I'm about to get. I'm going to, you know, get into a health insurance that will facilitate being able to, like, afford therapy as well. But, yeah. Therapy isn't just something that people say to do. And, you know, it's not just some band-aid, like, you know, school or something where people are like, oh, just do it. And then suddenly you'll get the things you want. You do have to shop around for the right therapist. But it does help. I wish my parents let me grow my hair out. It's not like men don't grow out their hair, but I want to grow it out to look more femme. I would look so freaking nice with long hair. Dude, when you when you get out of your parents' place, when you're able to financially take care of yourself, grow your hair out. Hair out. Trust me. Like, experiment. See what you can do with your body that makes you feel good. Uh... Oh, random person says you have curly hair. I've got curly hair too. Oh, that would be that would be a great femme look. Like, uh, depending on how curly your, your hair is, it can be really, really cute too. Like, I mean, any curly hair is really cute, honestly. As one curly haired person to another, yes. When you can, do it. Do it. Michael Rosenbaum's Inside of You podcast is an okay therapy substitute as well. I, a surprisingly amount of guests, uh, open up, uh, extremely personal struggles. Okay. Okay, I've not heard of that, but, okay. I'm not suggesting, uh, empty inside as a therapy substitute, but more as a, like, a thing to, like, help you understand that you're not alone, and how other people have approached and understand issues that you might be feeling as well, I guess. And just hearing about other people's experiences with them. It's definitely not a therapy substitute, but it's a nice thing to help you get on the road to recovery that therapy would m more appropriately facilitate. I posted a funny meme in memes and such. Okay, I will go check that out. And actually, I'm going to get out of this because I think we're done Jackbox Gamings for the night. No, that is not what I wanted to do. Thank you. I tell you, these games, man. Uh, yeah, let's quit. Okay, let's go to memes and such. I have to scroll down because I usually don't look at memes and such. Big time homo. Mmm. Hmm. I don't really, I don't know how I feel about that. Someone added me on the real not a vampire. What the fuck is that? <laughs> what is that, Faith? I don't get it. <laughs> oh. Mm. Okay. Are we talking podcasts? Terrible thanks for asking. Uh, I don't know that one. Well, do you mean I grow mine because it's fun to get yours done and just have a night letting someone scratch your head for hours. Also, curly hair management and... It's a struggle, real, real, though. Yeah, curly hair is hard to manage. I do agree. But it also looks nice. The thing that I recommend for curly hair management is to never brush your hair uh, dry. Always brush it wet. That will get the best um, ringlets and curls out of your hair. Uh, oh, that's, that's what rutabaga looks like? Huh. Okay. 
it was relevant a while ago. I do agree with you. Yeah, yeah, okay. Um, the hair is curly, like it's kind of perm, but not overly curly, like Emma's during Spike and Snake's wedding. <laughs> oh, okay. Uh, don't trust school counselors if you are still in K through 12 and under 18 BTW. Yeah, agreed. It's it's unlikely that school counselors will actually help you and more likely that they'll tell your parents on you. So don't trust them. Uh, second faith says I came out to school and accidentally added him to my dad. That's not good. That's a turnip. Uh, is it though? Is it? Uh, isn't any counselor always strictly better than none? Um, I don't know, Trinket Mage. I don't know. I guess it depends. It depends on if they are the kind of person to, like, you know, go back to the parents and, like, talk about everything. If there's someone like Sauve where they don't go to the parents, then yes, they're, that's good. But if there's someone who you feel like who, you know, who will go back to the parents and say, hey, uh, this is going on, then I wouldn't trust it because I know it would not have helped Ellie for you know, so vague to tell her mom about her cutting. That would not have helped. Uh, school is literally designed to program you into a compliant worker. Yeah, uh, sounds like you agree with, uh, Tarbuck, and yeah. Yeah, I can't really argue against that. Uh, school counselors will tell your parents almost anything you say, even when it doesn't need to be shared. Agree. Never trust the system. Fuck them all. T say nothing. Take care of yourself. I'm you, back, by the way. I, I was to... I was fighting with a landlord. I still am. What? There's a there's a uh, I'm in the Vic and Hope Discord chat, and uh, I'm currently arguing with a landlord over whether having over oh. whether owning property counts as work. I heard lamp lord. <laughs> okay. Uh, let's see. A random person likes to joke that when we meet, he'll pet my head nonstop because it looks soft. I don't see it, but it's probably because I'm dummy. No, you're not a dummy. Like, you don't see it because you're not, like, you're not on the outside. You're used to viewing, like, experiencing it all the time as you. Whereas random person... Hasn't like experienced it before. It's not that you're dumb. It's just that you experience it one way, and random person experiences another. Um, school counselors put me on suicide watch for all in middle school for a short story murder mystery series I was writing because a character killed himself in it. School counselors are dumb. Yeah, yeah. I mean, some of them do try, but honestly, they don't do it right. Still. I told my school counselor I was a goth, and my parents sent me to a psych ward. It was a good noodle after that. I was a good noodle after that. Yikes. Play Roblox? Uh, JK, JK. Unless, I don't know, I've never tried Roblox games. Keep your head down, stay safe until you get out forever. Yeah, I agree with Faith. That's the best way to do it. Do what you gotta do to take care of yourself. And then as soon as you're out and you can do it, get therapy, get help. And again, number one, take care of yourself. Nine times out of ten, that uh, that their parents are garbage is why kids are needing counseling to start with. Yep. Unfortunately, like there are good parents out there, from what I understand, but a lot of them aren't. There's no prerequisite to having parents. There's no test. There's no qualifications. All you gotta do is have sex. That's the only thing that makes you a parent, and like and so. A lot of garbage people become parents. Most garbage people become parents. So, it's not... It's not crazy to recognize that your parent, that parents can be garbage. It's like just the reality of the world. A lot of them are. And, again, you gotta take care of yourself. Uh, bird in the cage doesn't know how fresh air feels until it can fly, buddy. Yep, agree with Chuck. Uh, trinket with the tea, with the coffee or tea? Yeah, agreed. Faith Miller, uh, been there, done that, got the t-shirt, didn't fit it, lol. I won't talk about it here, but I did something dumb in 8th grade, and my parents don't didn't get me help because they refused to believe anything was wrong with their son. Yeah. That, that's stupid. 
Um, Millie Noodles. Hello, Claire or Darcy? Claire, because I grew up with Claire. Uh, hello, Sal. Hello, uh, Syrian boy. Hello, everyone. Uh, Zach got the Jugo. Uh, hello, people who joined the Discord. I think it's time to go because my throat hurts. I need to go to bed. Yeah. And thank you very much for joining us. Like, this was fun. Um, chill out with us again uh, in the future. And until next time, have a good night. Um, stay safe out there, like whether that be from coronavirus or from your parents even. Take care of yourself. That's honestly the best thing you can do for yourself. Because you're worth it. Have a good night.